yeah, I, I just did a tour uh, in the States um, and yeah, I finished in a venue in San Francisco called the Palace of Fine Arts. Wow. Which is very prestigious. Wow. But life comes at you fast. I then came back and the first show I had back in England was in a leisure centre in Colchester. <laughs> where they had badminton nets in my dressing room and it all smelled of deep heat. And I was like... Yeah. It's good to keep yourself grounded keep in that way. Keep yourself grounded, yeah. But the, uh, before we talk about the stand-up then, um, but you have, you've been making movies. You've been making lots of movies. Yeah. Successful movies. Yeah. Clifford, the big red dog... Yeah. Took, he's in that why, film. Why are you laughing? <laughs> it's popular family entertainment. Yeah. I am not saying anything negative about it. I like that kind yeah. of film. They're hard to make. It, took over, it made over $100 million. Yes. I mean, that's a lot of money. Yeah, that is a lot of money. How much of that do you get? Not a lot. <laughs> <laughs> but how great to be in successful films like this. Yeah, no, it's great. I mean... Was I the costume very hot? <laughs> 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 Everyone assumed I was the dog as well. <laughs> Even after, you know, they'd seen the trailer and people were coming up to me going, are you the dog in that? I was like, no, you can literally see me in the poster. <laughs> <laughs> well, you give off the vibe of someone who would be employed more for their voice than their looks. <laughs> OK. <laughs> Speak, wow. so I would just be woofing and grunting. Yeah. 